Hello, hello. Good evening. Hello, class. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hello. 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 How are you? Hello, teacher. Hello, welcome. I'm fine, thanks. Excellent. I am very happy to meet you all, right? I am very, very glad to meet all of you. Hello, Mr. Jorge, Adriana, Brian, Cynthia. Welcome. Sebastiana Guadalupe. What a beautiful name. Ana Isela, Diana, Mr. David, and all the ones that are connecting to the class. Welcome. It is a great happiness for me to meet you, right? Estaba muy ansiosa de conocer a los que no conocía y de volver a ver a los que ya conocía. I was very, very happy to, to see you again. So welcome to your class. Thank you for being on time. I really appreciate that. Thank you for being on time. I am sorry that I was finishing the previous class. Si de repente se conectan, Y sale ahí que el, el hospedador todavía está en otra reunión. Es porque estoy terminando la clase previa con los estudiantes. Y así que, so just give me one or two minutes and I will be here with you. Okay. So it is a big pleasure to have you all here. How do you feel? Uh -huh. ¿Cómo se sienten este día? ¿Cómo se sienten de iniciar otra vez? Excited, nervous. <laughs> How do you feel? Good? Bad. I'm excited. I'm excited. Yes, I... <clears throat> Sorry. You feel excited. Okay. How else do you feel? ¿Cómo se sienten los demás? Veamos. How do you feel? Nervous? Excited? Happy? I don't know. Tell me. Nervous and happy. Nervous and happy, says Dianita. Okay, what about the rest? Cuéntenme los demás. Uh -huh. How do you feel? Fine, fine. Nice to meet you. Now you're feeling fine. Nice to meet you too, right? Nice to meet you as well. For me, it's a great pleasure to have you here. Don't feel nervous, okay? It is normal. It is normal to feel like that. Maybe for the ones that I, I know already, right? Cynthia, I just saw her on Thursday, right? A Cynthia la dejé de ver el jueves. <laughs> and I'm seeing her again here. So that's very good. Mr. Roberto, welcome. I know Mr. Roberto as well. So for all the ones that are new for me, welcome. It will be a great happiness to work with all of you, right? I am more than glad to be here with all of you. So let me introduce myself. I am going to introduce myself. Maybe that is going to help a little bit to, to release stress. Quizás nos va a ayudar un poquito a, a sentirnos menos estresados. All, all the new days are, are like this. I, I really love English, right? So if you want to practice, if you want to learn, if you want to improve your English, I am going to try to speak English during the complete class. If you need something, if you don't understand something, you can tell me, teacher, can you explain again? Can you please tell me? Can you please help me? But try to practice your English as well, okay? Let's see. Let me share my screen with all of you, and I'm going to talk a little bit about myself. Here we go. So I really welcome you to my class. I am very, very happy to meet all of you and to have all my previous students again. It is very nice for me to see all of you in class. Congratulations for being here. Felicidades a todos por estar aquí. Sé que es un esfuerzo grande, pero vale la pena. Todo esto vale la pena. So please continue doing it. So, this is your teacher. I sent you a little message. En la mañana les mandé un mensajito al grupo de presentación. And so you know my name, right? And everything about me. Good evening. Hello, Sandrita. Welcome. Mucho gusto. Gusto de verte nuevo. Siento que te vi el Igualmente. 
<laughs> Igualmente. So, this is me, right? This is me. This is your teacher. My name is Evelyn Natalie Monterrosa de Flores. I am a licenciada en idioma inglés. And I have a lot of experience on this, right? For, for my previous students, they know me already, right? I, estudiantes con los que ya me presenté. And they know me. But for many of you, I am new. So I am a uh, licenciada en idiomas, right? I have a lot of different courses and certifications on English. I love planning. I love teaching by competences. Uh, I am an English expert in progress, right? Digo en, en progreso, en proceso. I have been a teacher for half of my life. Llevo la mitad de mi vida en esto. So I have done many things. I have been a teacher at Universidad Católica de Occidente, at Instituto Americano de Idiomas in Santa Ana, at a foundation in Santa Ana. I worked for Programa Empresarial Superate for 10 years, and I worked for Regal International for two years now. Ya tengo dos años trabajando para inglés corporativo. And I am a principal at English Learning Center. Soy directora de English Learning Center San Salvador. And for sure, I am a Teaching Excellence alumni of Fulbright. Fui representante del, el, de, de la excelencia en enseñanza. Es una beca que entrega la Embajada Americana. Se llama Fulbright. Y tuve la oportunidad de ir a aprender cómo enseñar a eh, Arkansas en Estados Unidos. Estuve allá el año pasado por más de dos meses. Así que... Eh, This is me. This is the teacher that you have here. And I love to teach. I love to do what I do. And for sure, to teach and learn every single day from you. So I always have class agreements, right? These are the things that I love to do with you. These are the things that I love to do with my students. What is the first one? Can you help me to read it? ¿Cuál es el primero? Practice your English as much as possible. Practice your English as much as possible. Thank you, Brian. Number two. Ask for help when needed. Ask for help when needed, right? Cuando necesiten ayuda. Don't doubt, don't hesitate. Ask for help. Number three. Keep your cameras on all the time. Keep your cameras on all the time. So please, I need to see all the cameras on. Thank you, Guadalupe. Thank you, Cynthia, Roberto, Sandrita, Wendy, Tati, no puedo ver tu cámara, Lorena, Adriana, Jorge, Brian, Isela. I need to see your cameras and I will tell you why. Okay, ya le voy a explicar por qué la cámara es tan importante. Eh, Lorena, I cannot see your camera. Diana, David, Laurita, Mr. Eric Javier, and Carlos Ernesto. Help me with your cameras. Necesito ver todas las cámaras activadas. And you might say, I know, teacher, es que ando aquí toda despeinada. It's okay. It's okay. I don't care if you are despeinado, if si aquí está desordenado, si se me ve aquí el chucho, el gato. It's okay. Because what I need to see is that you are in the class. Okay? Yo necesito ver que usted está en la clase. Okay? Si de repente que ahí tiene el vasito con café, el vasito con soda, con agua, whatever. But I need to see you in the class. Because that is like the most important part. It's like, ay, teacher, es que a veces pasa mi papá aquí atrás en calzoneta. It's, it's okay. I mean, we are not going to focus on that. Lo que me interesa es que ustedes estén presentes. Y un estudiante presente es un estudiante que aprende. ¿Por qué? Porque sé que está. Porque sé que pone atención. Porque sé que ha preparado ese espacio para aprender. Okay, so please, I will be waiting for the rest of cameras. And... Uh, Um, if I see you, for sure I can have you participating. Mientras los veo, puedo incluirlos en participación. Porque de repente no tengo cámaras y estoy ahí, Nati, 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 por allá preparando un huevo. So please, I need to see your cameras activate uh, during the whole class. Los 60 minutos que vamos a estar juntos, saquémosles todo el provecho posible, siempre en cámara. Que me dice, ay, teacher, es que aquí... Está despintada la pared. It's okay. Yo les agradezco que me dejen entrar en sus casas. No importa si se ve desordenado, despintado, lo que sea. Lo que me importante, lo importante aquí es la persona. O sea, usted es lo más importante. So please uh, help me with this. Lorena, Dianita, David. 
Eric, Carlos, en Ana Ruth, en Tati. Ok, que me diga, mira, voy en el carro. It's ok, aunque le da la quijada ahí en el carro. It's ok. <ríe> Aquí que va manejando y pone el teléfono. It's perfect, right? That's good. Thank you. Thank you, Dianita. And I can meet you as well, right? No podemos ver. And that's beautiful. What is the next one? Number five. Attend. What is number five? Attend, Attend all, all your sessions on time. Attend all your sessions on time, right? Attend all your sessions on time. Thank you for being here on time. Number six. Um, participate as much as possible. Participate as much as possible, right? Participate as much as possible. Every opportunity is important to participate. Number seven. Keep a cooperative attitude during class. Keep a cooperative attitude during class. So for sure, we are going to do many crazy things. We are going to play, we're going to practice, we're going to talk, we're going to do many things. So keep a cooperative attitude during class. De repente decimos, hey, se acabó la hora. ¿Por qué? Porque no estuvimos practicando, estuvimos riendo, no estuvimos haciendo conversaciones, estuvimos haciendo juegos, whatever, in order to learn, okay? Number eight. Eight. Collaborate. Collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. Collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. And number nine, that it's new for us. Practice. Uh -huh. Practice every day with the audio activity. Practice every day with the audio activity. I am going to send you a link because we are going to practice with that every day, okay? I am going to send you a link for you to practice an audio every day, okay? Les voy a enviar una página donde está una lista de audios que vamos a ocupar todos los días. So I need you to practice with that every day. And in the class, I am going to say, okay, ¿cuántos audios hiciste ahora? ¿Cuántos audios practicaste? Y ahí vamos a ir reportando, okay? Uh, Guadalupe hizo tres, Guadalupe hizo dos. Jorge hizo uno. Uh, Isela no pudo hacer ahora, pero va a ser mañana. So, you are going to see. I am going to send it on the WhatsApp group. ¿Todos están en el grupo de WhatsApp? Yes? Yes. 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 Okay, perfect. Because I am going to send you a lot of practice, okay? Ahí me van a ver en la mañana. Hello, good morning. And I will send you homework. I will send you practices. I will send you links. Because my purpose is to make you better students, ok, mi propósito siempre va a ser retarlos a que den el 100% como estudiantes ok, así que si no te gusta hacer tareas, si no, ay, que, uh, nothing, with me it's impossible, you need to work, right, it's like you work or you work, aquí o habla o habla, si no tenemos referentes aquí, Sandrita, Cintia Wendy it's like aquí trabajamos o trabajamos Y trabajamos un montón y nos divertimos un montón. And we have a lot of fun. So, that it's going to be, uh, that's going to be our agreements for the night. Those are going to be the agreements of the day. Important things to follow, right? Important things to follow in classes, for sure, are the different advantages that you need to take of your virtual class. And... I always share these ones because they are important. Let me share them with you as well. What are the different things that you need to do for your virtual class? The first one says, participate as much as you can during class. Enjoy this learning moment for yourself, okay? Este momento de aprendizaje es suyo. Aproveche. Enjoy this learning moment for yourself. Because do you have the opportunity to practice English during the day? Tienen la oportunidad de practicarlo en su casa, en su trabajo, en su colonia, con su familia. ¿No? Do you practice English at home? Yes. If you can do it, take advantage of that because not many people yes, can do teacher. it. That's, <laughs> if you can. Okay, that's good. So if you have the opportunity to practice, do it. Okay. If not, take the best advantage here in the classroom. Number two, set your space. Dress nice but comfortable. And keep your notebooks and pens at hand. Okay? Cuadernos, what are you? What are your notebooks? Entonces, cuadernos. 
Where is your notebook? Do you have a notebook? Can you show it to me? Show me your notebook and your pen. Okay, you need one. Okay, if you don't have one, you need to get one because you're going to use it. Lo ocupamos. Si no, quítale uno al niño ahí de la mochila. It's okay. It's a hijo, lo siento. <laughs> Del paquete escolar. Give me one. Number three, take notes and ask questions. Don't say, ay, que me da pena. Ay, que no, que no es que. Ask questions, okay? If you don't want to do it in the chat, if you don't want to do it in the group, si no lo quieren hacer en el chat de Zoom, hágalo a mi WhatsApp directamente. So ask questions, okay? And it is important. If I am busy, send them on the chat. If I am explaining something, put it on the chat in Zoom, right? Todos conocen el chat de Zoom, it's right here. Hello, okay? Yes. If I am busy, you can yes, send me, can. you can send me the questions right there. And stay away from pets and family that might distract you or interrupt you, okay? Si su familia está toda en la sala, no reciba la clase en la sala. Porque va a estar, mamá, mira, mira que el chucho, mira el gato, mira que el gato, look for a space, okay? Si de repente al gato le encanta estar en el comedor y usted, ay, me voy a ir para el comedor porque ahí está el michi. No, because it's going to distract you. So look for a place with no distractions. It's impossible in some cases in Salvadorian houses, okay? Nuestras casas a veces son tan chiquitas que veo para allá alguien, veo para que hay alguien, veo para allá hay alguien. <laughs> so, but try to find a place, right? Try to find a place. And the last one, keep away any device or television that might distract you. In some cases you say, I'm going to be here in the class and there with the television. It's not possible. No podemos estar en la tele y en la clase al mismo tiempo. Because you're like, ah, oh my God. Ah. And then you're going to watch the, the TV and you're going to forget about teacher Nati. So please stay away from the television, right? The cell phone, maybe we're going to use it, right? Vamos a usar el teléfono de, de vez en cuando. Pero yo le voy a avisar cuando. So keep it there. So that's important. Remember, I am going to call attendance every day. And for sure, it is important to have all this time in the class, right? All the classes are important and the 60 minutes of the class is important, right? I cannot give you permissions, right? Los permisos no están disponibles para esta clase. So please, if it is an emergency, let people from Inglés Corporativo know. But if it is an emergency, right? Sleeping is not an emergency. Uh, eating is not an emergency. You can eat in the class, okay? Ahí rapidito se pueden comer algo and that's it, right? I will try not to ask you questions. And for sure, try to be present during the complete class. Remember uh, the bottoms, if we are not using the microphone, keep it mute. The camera on, please. The breakout rooms, in some cases we are going to work together. Lo voy a mandar a trabajar en grupos. Trabajen en los grupos in English, for sure. You can raise your hand, right? Pueden levantar la manita para hacer preguntas. Enseñenme si saben dónde está la manita para hacer preguntas. Ajá. There you go. I need you to raise your hand. Very good job, all of you. know I love this type of students that are so technological and fantastic. Excellent. Thank you very much. Oh, yes. You know how to use the reactions. Perfect. So that is uh, everything that we need to know for a... Uh, this part of the class, okay? These are like the general things that we need to know. And it is important, right, to review them. Siempre es importante recordarlas. So what is the calendar of activities that we're going to have? What is the calendar of activities for us? We have four weeks from now. Vamos a hacer juntos cuatro semanas. And we are going to go. In the first week, we need to finish sections one and two in the platform. In week number two, sections three and the midterm exams. Week number three, sections four and five, and week number four, the final exams. We are going to finish the course on July 13, right? A veces el tiempo se nos va volando. Son solo 16 días los que los tengo conmigo. So we need to take the best advantage of these days. And let me see. Any question, people? Did you uh, 
Did you have the chance to access the platform? Journal of Cultural yeah, Teacher, okay. Mrs. Okay, remember on the platform, you can download the manual, right? You can download your manual on the platform and I am going to open it right now to show you where you can get your manual on the platform here. Let me see. It is important that you have it, okay? Si sí es importante que descarguen el manual because we use it in class, right? We're going to use it and you need it. You need it for the class. So please download it. And I know that you, that you have done it, yes? I did. I did what? You, da you downloaded it already, yes? yes? ¿Ya lo descargaste? Yes. Okay, good. It's important. In some cases, people like to print it. Hay chicos que les gusta imprimirlo para tenerlo ahí a la mano. So if you want to do it, you can do it as well. Okay? Eso es opcional. Si ustedes lo quieren hacer, that's okay. But if you want to use it in PDF, that's correct as well. Okay, and here. I am going to open it. Let me see if I can do it. Okay. Está renuente mi internet. But I am opening right now. And here we go. So in the platform, you are going to have the chance to see the different exercises that we are going to work. Ahí pueden ver los ejercicios que vamos a trabajar. And you can also see the videos of the classes that we are always studying, right? That it's on the platform. And for sure, the manual, it's also there. Here, I am going to share it with you in a second. Here it is. Ya lo encontré, ya lo tengo. It's right here. So, as you can see here, this is your platform. Esa es su plataforma, right? I know that you have been there. I didn't ask, sorry. ¿Hay alguien aquí que esté por primera vez? Que haya entrado hasta este módulo? Who? Sí. Okay, I need to see the. Uh -huh. De hecho, no tengo el link de la plataforma. No sé si me lo pueden compartir por Perfect. WhatsApp. Por Perfect. Okay, Thank I am you. going to I am going to do it. Okay. Eh, también en el correo de confirmación que te envían está el link a la plataforma. But I will share it with you. Yo se lo voy a enviar. Don't worry. El link de la clase también mm -hmm. lo encuentran en la descripción del grupo. Okay, so that's important. So this is the platform, right? This is the platform that you are going to be working in each section. It has five sections, right? On each of the sections, you have different exercises. And in here, right? Here on the top of it, al, uh, en la parte de arriba, en las opciones, tenemos a student's manual number three. And what you are going to do with this one, you are going to open the link and here you are going to download. Aquí tiene esta flechita para descargarlo. So you click there in descargar and you are going to get it in PDF, okay? Or you can watch it right here. But the idea is that you have it and you download it, okay? So you can find your manual there. En el manual están todas las clases que vamos a ir viendo, okay? And let me see, you will open it like this. Okay, so this is what you are going to get on the menu. So please, I need you to download this for tomorrow. Para el día de mañana necesito que todos lo tengan descargado. And we are going to be doing these five units of the modules. Okay. And yo no encuentro el manual en el grupo. Okay, it is not in the group. It is on the platform. But I will send it to the group as well. Se lo voy a enviar al grupo también. Give me a second. Gracias. I will do it for sure. Aquí, servicio completo. <laughs> ah, thank you. I will, I will send it to the group right now. Okay, so please uh, work on the platform. Work on, on this. This is going to be very helpful and beneficial for you. So, but too much talking about me. Ya mucho hablé, yo hoy les toca hablar a ustedes. 
this is, uh, we're going to continue here with the class. And for sure, we're going to get to know you, right? Because I have been talking and talking and talking a lot, but I need you to introduce yourself. I need to know about you and I need to see you and to get to meet you a little bit. So let's get to know you a bit better. We are going to start practicing with the little groups and I am going to send you to work with some partners. And on the group, what you are going to do is that you are going to introduce yourself, a specific information about you, your name, where do you live, what are the things that you like, uh, why are you studying English? And okay, so you need to give me general important information about you. I need to talk about Juanita. Juanita, Juanita, can you listen to me now, Juanita? Juanita decía en el chat que no podía escuchar a la bicha. Hola. Si no desconecte sus audífonos, Juanita. Eso va a ser un problema. Y quédese con el audio del device. So, we're going to go to working groups. We're going to work in mini groups. And you are going to introduce yourself. Se van a presentar con su grupo. Quienes son, eh, cómo se llaman, qué les gusta hacer, cuántos años tienen, etc., etc. Okay? It's going to be only four groups because we're going to do this very quick. It's going to be only, let me see, five minutes. Okay, vamos a estar nada más cinco minutos en el grupo. So please, I need you to take good advantage of the time. Introduce yourself and share important information about yourselves. Open your cameras in the groups, okay? And accept my invitation. Accept my invitation to go to the groups. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Thank you, Lorena. Accept my invitations, please. Lorena, Ana Ruth, Roberto. Accept my invitations. Chicos. Okay, Carlos Ernesto, hello. Carlos se sacó del grupo. Here we go again. Thank you. Ana Ruth, no te digo mi invitación. Lorena, no te digo mi invitación al grupo. Okay, please accept my invitations. Hello, hello. Okay, let's go and see. Now that all of them are in the groups, let's go and see how they are doing with the introductions. Um, 
in this moment, um, I have uh, the class, the English in my house. Um, I have a manager assistant. Nice information. Very good job. Continue. Creo que voy yo. Hello, my name is, is Laura. Uh, I am 22 year old. I live in, in Soyapango. And currently work. I currently work. Very good job. Continue. Who's next? <laughs> Hello. Hello, teacher. Uh, Hola. What Al happened? Hay problemas de audio. Eh, Diego mm -hmm. creo que eres, solo ve, no escucha y Juanita, Juana Martínez creo no escucha, solo ve, no sé cómo. <laughs> okay, Diego. Pero con Roberto ya nos presentamos porque ya hemos estado. Entonces, yeah. we know each other, right? As you would. <laughs> okay, Diego. Diego, can you can you listen to me? Okay, let's go back. We're going to try to fix it. Diego and Juanita, I will keep them in mind. Lo voy a esperar allá. Vámonos de regreso. Welcome back. We had a little bit of time to introduce ourselves, right? Fue un poquitito de tiempo que tuvimos, but we're going to have the chance to actually do this a little bit better. Well, before anything happens, I'm going to call the attendance to see if I have all my students. Le voy a pasar lista. Please, when you listen to your name, you can answer in two ways. You can say here or present, okay? ¿Cómo me pueden contestar? Here, here or, pre or present. present. Okay, you can choose in either here or present, right? So, uh, Ana Isela Janis? Present. Very good. Ana Ruth Perez. Present. Brian Francisco. Present. Carlos Ernesto Flores. Present. Cintia Marisol Mejía. Present. David Alejandro Rodríguez. Here. David Rafael Ramos. David Rafael Ramos. Let me see if I see him. Okay, si lo ven por ahí y yo no lo veo, me avisan. It's okay. Let's continue. Let's continue here. Eh, Diego Rodrigo. Oh, Dieguito cannot use the microphone, right? But he is here. Diana Beatriz. Present. Eric Javier. Present. Thank you. Fatima Ibin. Fatima Ibin. Jorge Francisco. Present. Josué Abel. Present. Juana Margarita. Ah, Juanita cannot use the, 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 the microphone. Yeah, I, I, I know. Catherine Jamilet. Catherine Jamilet. Catherine. No, no, vamos a Catherine. The next one. Laura Lisset. Present teacher. Lorena Araceli. Present teacher. Mirna Yasmin. Present teacher. Thank you. Eh, Oscar Otoniel. Oscar Otoniel. Oscarcito. No, I don't have Oscar. Reina Yael. Here. Roberto Carlos. Here, teacher. Sandra Beatriz. Present, teacher. Uh, Sebastián Guadalupe. Present, teacher. Tatiana Abigail. Present. Thank you. 
Úrsula Adriana. Present. And Wendy Lisette. Present. Okay, perfect. Almost perfect attendance. We're missing David Rafael, Fatima Ivin. We're missing, uh, let me see, Catherine Jamilet and Oscar Otoniel. Okay, those were the ones that are missing today. So let's continue with the class today. We are going to work today a little bit on, okay, getting to know you, right? We did this one and I need three volunteers. This is three volunteers, go ahead. I need three volunteers. Raise your hand, remember. Raise your hand, three volunteers. Tatiana, Jorge, and Reina. Okay, ya tengo tres. Tatiana, can you introduce yourself? Okay, my name is Tatiana Rodriguez. I am 22 years old. I live in Sayapango, and this moment I don't work. And my hobbies are listening to music and practice English every day. A very good job. Claps for Tatiana, people. Vamos a ver un aplauso para Tatiana. Muy bien, muy bien. You did a good job. Son gratis, okay? Don't worry. <laughs> they are for free. You can clap, Tatiana. It's okay. Mr. Jorge Francisco, go ahead. Hello, good evening. Good evening. And my name is George. I'm 28 years old. Actually, I don't work, and I can I can learn English. Okay, good. I am I am here to learn English. Thank you very much, Jorgito. Reactions for Jorgito. Very good job. And Reina, go ahead. Hello, everybody. My name is Reina Jaén. I am 13 years old. I love listening to music. My favorite food is Chinese Chinese food. Um, only that. And only that. I live in Soya City. In Soya Pango City, right? Yes. And for sure, say I am 30 years old. 30, 30, 30, right? I'm 30 years old. Very good job. Very good job. And for sure, we are going to have the chance to continue introducing ourselves. But a little bit of today's class, it's about reviewing the months of the year, right? This is not a very unknown topic. Esto no es algo que no lo conozcan because I know that you have studied this before. Yo sé que ya lo estudiaron antes. And for sure, you have studied this with your teacher. And let's see, well, the ones who started with me, we started this a little bit on the previous module. And for the ones that are new with me, we're going to review. The first, the first month of the year, it's January, right? January, it's not January, okay? It's January. Practice with me, you say January. 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 February. January. January. February. 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 March. 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 April. 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 May. 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 June. 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 July. 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 August. 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 September. 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 October. October. November. 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 December. 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 Okay. Is there any of them that you have problems with? Hay alguno que les dé problemas? August. 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 Imagínese que le ponen una O al principio. You say August. August. Another one that it's difficult for you? Enero, teacher. January. 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 Okay, I will repeat them. Okay, listen and practice with me. You say January. 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 February. 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 March. 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 April. 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 May. 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 June. 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 July. 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 August. August. September. 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 October. October. November. 
November. November. December. December. Tell me, what is your favorite month of the year? What is your favorite month? January, April. April, it's April, November. January. December. August. December. December. March. March. My favorite May. is September. May. May is your favorite. What is your least favorite? El que menos le gusta. What is your least favorite? December. I'm the green. January. <laughs> August. January. August. August. <laughs> I, don't, I don't like July. I don't know. I don't like July. It's too long, right? Tiene como 80 días. July is like three months in one. There is no festivities in July. No hay festivos. No hay, no hay nada. Well, if you live in Santa Ana, yes. Is there someone from Santa Ana here? Hay alguien from Santa Ana? No? Alguien de Santa Ana? No? Well, in no. Santa Ana, Jorge, yes? I close, close. So in Santa Ana, they have the parties in July. So they have like 15 days of parties, right? Hay como 15 días que fiesta, 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 fiesta. And that's cool. But here in San Salvador, nothing. So July is like three months in one, right? Yo le digo que es el tres meses en uno. It's a very long month. And you don't have any vacation, right? No hay celebración, no hay vacación, no hay nada, right? There's nothing in July. So I, I don't like July. So the December, who likes December? Raise your hand if you like December. I love December. I mean, yeah. I think that from the moment they start with the Christmas lights, I love it, right? Si ponen poquito de octubre, ya de octubre me gustan. I love Christmas. Christmas is my favorite season of the year. Everything is so shiny and happy and colorful. I love it. So. Tell me, what is the first month of the year? What is the first January. month? January. 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 What is the January. fifth month of the year? The fifth? May. 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 What is the seventh month of the year? July. 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 What is the tenth month of the year? October. 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 What is the fourth? April. 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 What is your favorite? April. May. January. December. <laughs> January, December. May. Okay. January, it's a hard month, right? Enero es el año más difícil del, del año. <laughs> it's, the, it's the most difficult month, right? Everything it's is my a, favorite. Is, your, is it your birthday on January? Yes. Ah, that's why. I love September because it's my birthday. In which month is your birthday, people? April. April. My birthday is June. June. In, it's in, in June, right? Important pronunciation. You say? Wait, wait. Birthday. 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 Because if you say my birthday, birthday, it's another thing, right? A beer, it's a drink, right? Si me dicen a beer, es una cerveza. If you say my beer day, it's Friday. <laughs> no, right? My beer day is Saturday. So you say my birthday. Yeah. Birthday. So please, in the next holidays, in the next celebrations, don't say happy birthday to you. No, you say happy birthday. birthday. Happy birthday to you. Okay, you still have Usted va a ser el que cante bonito de la familia, el happy birthday, right? Y les enseña a todos para que no digan happy birthday to you. No, not anymore, okay? Doy en adelante. Happy birthday to you. Birthday. So you say, my birthday is on, and then you give me the month, okay? My birthday is on, and you tell me September, August, July, etc. So the phrase will be, my birthday, birthday is on, and you tell me the month, okay? My birthday is on September. Reina? My birthday, my birthday. My is birthday on. is April. My birthday is on? 
My birthday is on April. Very good. April. April. Jorge? My birthday is on April. April as well. Uh, Guadalupe? My birthday is on May. May. Very good. Sandra Beatriz? My birthday is on December. Very good. Cynthia Marisol? My birthday is on December. Excellent. Josue Abel? My birthday is on December. Excellent. Wendy Lisette? My birthday is on December. On December. Roberto Carlos? December. My birthday is on May. On May. Very good. Brian Francisco? My birthday is on June. June. Fatima Ibin? My birthday... No, birthday is on December. My birthday, right? My birthday is on December. Good, very good. Let me see. Let's continue with uh, Laura Lisette. My birthday is on August. August, August, August right, August. And Isela? My birthday is on January. Okay, my birthday, birthday. Diego Rodrigo? No sé si le funciona ya el audio a Diego. Tatiana Abigail? My birthday is on December. Very good, Eric Javier? Hello, my birthday is June. It's Hace on? Oh, happy birthday. <laughs> happy birthday. You know, exactly here, I have a present for you. Just give me a second. I have a present for you right here. Okay, le trajimos a hamburger. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> I brought a hamburger to you. Happy birthday, Eddie. May God give you lots of blessings. Diana Beatriz, what is your birthday? Hey. My birthday is on March. March, very good. Mirna Yasmin? My birthday is on August. My birthday is on August. David Rodriguez? My birthday is on October. October, October, good. Adriana Burgos? My birthday is on February. February, Carlos Ernesto? My birthday is September. It's on September. Good. Let me see. Eh, Juana Margarita, can you use the audio? No? Creo que nos no escribió al chat. Okay. Um, okay, Juanita, I will help you. Ana Ruth, when is your birthday? My birthday is on August. On August. Lorena Araceli? My birthday is on January. On January, very good. Am I missing someone? Hay alguien a quien no le he preguntado? Tell me now or keep silence forever. No? A quien no le pregunté, veamos. Sin pena, dígame a mí, teacher, no me preguntó. Everybody, did I ask everybody? Okay, good. So that is the answer for this question, right? When is your birthday? And you say, my birthday is on, and then you have it. Accompany this, accompany to this, we are going to study the adverb, the adverbs, <laughs> the ordinal numbers, right? We are going to study the ordinal numbers. These ones are going to help us with the dates, okay? Estos nos ayudan a complementar fechas, okay? And these are not, one, two, three, four. No, these are first, second, third, fourth, fifth, etc. So these ones in Spanish, which which type of numbers are these ones in Spanish? ¿Qué tipo de números son estos en español? Segundo, primero, tercero. Exactly like that, right? They are ordinal numbers. And as you can see here, as you can see here, they are ordinal numbers. And what you do here, is that, for example, on the written form, en la forma escrita, si se fijan, tiene 
algo bien peculiar. And you have these letters at the end. So you say first. Las últimas dos letras de la forma escrita son las que acompañan el número. So here you have, for example, first, and you have number one, ST. Okay? The only ones that are different are first, second, and third. Okay? And for the next ones, you have only TH because you have fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth. Right, 11th, 12th, 13th, 14th, 15th, and they have TH. What is the sound of this? Okay, el sonido de la TH al final del ordinal number es con su lengua en medio de sus dientes y deja salir el aire un poquito. You say, so you say, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, okay? Be careful to leave the air, right? Saquen el aire, no la saliva. <laughs> it's like, fourth. <laughs> so you say fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh. In this one, it's a little bit more challenging. En el 12 tienen el sonido de la F, que es. Así. And the twelfth. So it's a little bit more complicated. Say 12th. This one is 13th. Tienen el sonido al principio y el sonido al final. Say 13th. Mm -hmm. And this is the most difficult oh. one. ¿Por qué? Porque todos dicen 13 or 13. And it's 13 with the sound at the beginning and the sound at the end. So you say 13th. Mm -hmm. The next one is 14th, 15th, 16th, 17th, 18th, 19th, 20th, right? 20th. De ahí para allá son mucho más fáciles. Why? Because you say 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 24th, 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th. Don't say 2010, okay? <laughs> that's, a, that's a problem. Say 30th, 30th, and then 31st, 32nd, 33rd, 34th, 34th, 35th, 36th, 37th, etc., etc. The only ones that are different because they change are from 11th to 20th, okay? Esos quizás son los más complicaditos porque cambian because in the first one you say first first it's not first okay el problema más grande cuando estamos aprendiendo inglés es que la gente dice first first and it's not like that it's first okay first practice with me first 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 first, first. first. second second, second. Third. 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 Fourth. 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 Fifth. 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 Okay. Fifth. Recuerden el sonido de la F como Fifth. 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 Hey. Sixth. 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 Seventh. Seven. Seven. Eighth. 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 Ninth. 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 Tenth. <clears throat> 
28 29 29th 30th 30th 31st 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 okay now i know we need to but let's go back here okay let's go back to this one okay I'm going to go back to practice. The first question that I did is like, when is your birthday, right? The when is your birthday? And you told me my birthday is on uh, July, August, April, et cetera, et cetera, okay? Now we're going to add something extra. We say my birthday, it's on, and you are going to give me the month and the day. So if you talk about my birthday, so you say my birthday is on September 15th, okay? That's my birthday. When is your birthday? Send it on the chat, okay? Mandenmelo al chat. My birthday is on, and you say the month and the day, right? The month and the day. Here you have the days. Se lo voy a poner para que ustedes lo puedan ver. My birthday is on, and here you have, sorry, my birthday is on, and here you have the month and the date, okay? I will copy the question right here. I will make it bigger. So you say, my birthday, it's on, and here you have the date, my birthday is on, and here you have my example. This is my example. My birthday is on September 15th. Okay, and being my social chat. And I have many here. That's so cool. My birthday is on October 8th, December 27th. Excellent. My birthday is on December 18th. Thank you. My birthday is on June 22nd, February 2nd. Uh, my birthday is on January 31st. April 10th, okay, Jorge Francisco, 10th, quitemosle la H ahí, there you go, okay, my birthday is on December 27th, on May 12th, okay, all the months go with capital, okay, todos los meses tienen que ir con mayúscula porque es un nombre propio, so that's important to remember, my birthday is on December 2nd, okay, my birthday is on May 24th, excellent. So that's the way we use this. For example, if I ask you, when is Father's Day in El Salvador? When is Father's Day in El Salvador? What is your answer? Father's Day is on? Father's Day is on 17th. Uh -huh, June what, what? 17th. Excellent. It's on June 17th. 17th. When is Valentine's? Valentine's Day. Valentine, Val is on, Valentine's Day is on, is on 14, 14 February. February. 14 February, February or February 14. February. It's okay. February 14. 14. Si me dicen 14 February, es la forma British English, right? Es la forma inglés británico. Fe 14 February, it's okay. February 14 is American English and it's correct. When is Mother's Day? Mother's Day is on Mother's Day is on May? May 10th. May 10th. May 10th. When is your mother's birthday? ¿Cuándo es el cumpleaños de su mamá? My, my mother's, mother's birthday, birthday is, is on, on my April, April 29th. April 29th. 29th. Uh -huh. Let me see. When is Teacher yeah, Nati's birthday? September 15th. <laughs> September 15th. Teacher Nati's birthday is on September, September 15th. 15th. Re remember, it's not birthday, okay? 
Ay, no, 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 no me gusta. <risa> no me gusta la, la beer. O sea, no me gusta la cerveza. Entonces no puedo tener un día de cerveza. Teacher Natis, birthday. No, I don't like it, right? Pero si tienen ustedes su beer day, that's correct. That's okay. But the pronunciation is birthday. Es de nacimiento. Day. De nacimiento. En el otro nos nacen, pero el espíritu de bailar. <risa> <laughs> that's, that's the only thing that goes with the, with that one, right? So my birthday is on January 26th, they say on the chat. So that is how you use these, the ordinal numbers, the months and the dates. Tomorrow we are going to continue practicing a little bit more on this one. So please, I am going to send you an audio for the ordinal numbers, okay? Le voy a enviar un audio con los ordinal numbers para que los puedan ir practicando. So you can practice this for tomorrow and for sure, with the pronunciation of the months of the year, okay? I didn't, I didn't even feel the time, right? Here you have the question. When is your birthday? My birthday is on September 15th, okay? That is the form of the question and the answer. My dear students, my God, I didn't feel the time, right? El tiempo vuela cuando nos divertimos. I didn't feel the hour of class, oh my God. So. Continue practicing for tomorrow, my dear students. I am going to see you tomorrow at the same time in the same place. Have a beautiful night. It was a pleasure to meet you. Para mí ha sido un placer conocerles. And I am here to serve you and to help you. Soy aquí para servirles. Y pues, I will see you tomorrow for the next Thank class. See you tomorrow. Have a beautiful night. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye. Have a beautiful night. Good night. Sleep well. Bye-bye. Bye, David. See you. Bye. Have a good night. Bye-bye.